tonight. What the Whoa. F was that? What the f was that? It was a meow. What? what? Something like burning the back of my leg here. It was like a hot finger going. The shape of my face is changing. Oh my god. Whoa. Go up there. Oh, Sigh. Okay. Go, go, oh go, 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 go. Loftus Hall feels evil. We're continuing our haunted holiday in Ireland. And we've come to a remote location on the south coast, Hookhead in County Wexford. Looming high up on the cliffs overlooking the Celtic Sea is Loftus Hall. Abandoned for many years, this once grand manor is now said to be home to spirits from its turbulent past. With reports of voices, footsteps and sightings of a former resident, once we enter these hallways, we're sure for a lively evening. Joining me again to help with the investigation are my three celeb holiday guests. Geordie Shore on Love Island, Sam Gowland, who seems to be having second thoughts. So I've been to Ireland a few times, but this is a little bit different, to be honest with you. I thought this is going to be quite good, but no, I don't know if it was such a good idea. I didn't think ghosts were real until I actually seen one at the end of my bed. I seen a girl, about three or four year old, blue ribbons, blue and white dress, stood at the end of my bed shit myself. Because you do want something to happen, but at the same time you don't, because if it does happen, I mean, you, you rig it by yourself, technically. I just want to be touched. That's what I'm weird if I get touched. Not touched in that way, just touched by a ghost. Simon Webb from Blue can't wait to get going. I think there's always something exciting about, you know, creeping around historic buildings such as this, because these are the places that will have probably the, the most activity going on because of the history. For me, I'm just glad to be here and just let's get it on. I've had experiences, um, I've seen certain, what people have gone through. Sometimes it can, you can, these spirits can drain you or they can make you emotional. I've also felt sick before and, and I've heard noises and I've never actually seen a spirit as I see you. And finally, Celebs Go Dating's Nadia Essex is back for more. And this time, she's on a mission. Ghost hunting? is becoming my new favourite thing. I, like, I feel like I could do it as a little sideline. It just excites me. Tonight I want to actually see a ghost because I've felt it, I've had chills, I've been hot, I've been cold, I've had like sensations, but to actually see something with my eyeballs, that's like the next step. So I'm like, come on ghosts, let me see you. As always, psychic medium Alex and paranormal investigator Ashley are on board. And they'll be helped by a local ghost hunter, Tina Barco. Hi guys. Hi, hi there. Well, this is really, really exciting. Uh, so guys, welcome to Loftus Hall. This is the first time I've been in the building as well as you guys. So we're all seeing this for the very first time. But there's someone that's been here before, and that is Tina. Without giving us too much information, tell us a little bit about the property. Okay, well, the first building would have been here. It would be dating back to the 1100s. So that was a castle. And in the 1600s, the Loftus family took over and um, they'd done a lot of work on it then as well. We would love it if you would join us today and follow us around the building. Mm -hmm. And anything that Alex picks up on, okay. if you think that that's got a connection, please tell us because oh, we yeah. would absolutely love to know. Yeah, I'm, I've spent many nights here. so. Oh, good I luck can... to you. <laughs> I'm only doing an hour. Yeah. So, yeah. That's Thanks. all that's in the contract. So uh, it'll be interesting if there's names or anything picked up. And definitely. I won't say anything up until. Keep those lips sealed. We don't want to know anything else. Uh, I'm ready. Are you ready? I think no. so. Listen, I think we need to start. Celebrity Ghost Hunter Tina, where are we going? 
through these doors and we're going to go into the card room first. Okay. Ladies okay. first? No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Of course, the door creaks. Oh my god, there's hardly any ceiling in here. Ooh, really? Oh my god. Absolutely okay. freezing. Really cold. Did you feel that? Yeah. Guys, spread out. I feel really dizzy in this room. Ooh, look at that Come over here. So. Guys, get comfortable. Um, Alex. First thing I've got just said straight away, it's almost like a lady in waiting. Now, I'm not too sure what that means yet because I'm trying to let the energy build up. And it's odd because the energy's shifting and it's like a, a power shift between masculine energy and feminine energy as well. But it's almost like Almost like I'm seeing somebody who's a ruler, this is my this is my home, this is my domain, and you're coming into my home. I'm gonna start out and I want to draw the energy of the female spirits come forward. Give me your name, give me any information to yourself, connect with us here in the room. Got this strong female energy, and it's like she's coming forward and she's screaming, and her head's been taken off. Oh, oh my god! Tina, let me come to you. I mean, look, Alex has been picking up on quite a bit already. Okay. Any of this, anything you've experienced? Um, dominant male energy in this part of the house, definitely connected with that. Mm -hmm. A female energy would be a huge connection that a lot of people would have okay. had here. You all right? Shortness of breath? Just no, like a bit just, like that. Yeah, just a bit. I want to take yeah. the court off me. Take it off, Sam. You enjoy yourself. <laughs> you Go on, get your bros <laughs> out. I'm going to enjoy myself in here. What, what was that noise? Sound? Did you see that? Cheers, everyone. If that's you, can you do it again? That is yet. Ah. Even though it's... Ah. What? what? Something like burning the back of my leg here. What, 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 what? And you exactly, just realised it's not what hot exactly legs. Like a direct you. burn at the back of my is leg. Is that a red dot there? Literally. Can we get a light over here? Honestly, it's like literally felt like a cigarette burn. Just there like and there. It's not obviously as painful as a cigarette burn, but that's the only thing I can imagine. It was like it's near to. A, a hot finger but. going... And that's why I was like, ah, because it just went zzzz. Ow, and my leg again, here. Shut up, Nadia. Ow, I swear, like, the same. Move over here, here, Nadia, come over this way. Ow. Like, get a light on Nadia's leg. This don't feel right to me. Yeah. This all feels just a bit wrong. Absolutely well, boiling. Someone else yeah, feel it that's not like us, we're on the phone. It feels like I was got burnt, that's what it feels like. It's boiling. You can feel the heat from it, yeah? Well, nah. And that was stronger, and it, it felt like... If like... this is you affecting Nadia, <laughs> affect somebody else within the group, or make that noise again. I feel like something's burning here, you know. Is it? Look, something's I burning. swear to God. Whereabouts here? Yeah. Look, it's red. Here, look, see that? There. It's boiling. See it. Yeah, look. Coming up, we continue to feel the physical effects. <laughs> You're <all> right. Yeah. <laughs> As the atmosphere at Loftus Hall takes its toll. I need to <laughs> wait a minute. I can't go up yet. Things are hotting up at Loftus Hall. Ah, what? what? Something like burning the back of my leg. With both Nadia and Sam suffering from the same painful burning sensation. I feel like something's burning here, you know. Here, look, see that? There. It's a very old building. We know it's an old building. Why is why has it been left in this state? Like, why is there a massive hole in the ceiling? Why are the walls like they are? 
The legend of Loftus Hall is a dark stranger. It was a stormy night and they offered him um, shelter in here and he ended up having relations with the daughter of the house. This hole in the roof, um, they, they said that, it, that they were having a card game. Um, and Tottenham, the daughter of the house, bent down to pick up the card and she seen that he had cloven feet. Yeah. Uh, he was found out to be the devil in a fit of rage. He went up through the roof. Well, well, she'd never told us that now. I feel that there was a fire. So take away the legend, there would have been a fire or some, because I'm seeing someone being burnt, mm. but there was a lot what sort of just went shh and then had to be rebuilt. Well, yeah, I was going to say, that's why it was rebuilt, there was a fire. There was a fire. And you just said you felt like you got burnt? Yeah, that's exactly what it felt like. I mean, obviously it wasn't like a painful burn, but it definitely felt like tss. Right, no one's moving. It's not wind, is it? No. Ooh. That's not wind. That's what I said, breathing. I thought, was someone breathing that fire? Shh. I can hear like a song, like an old time song. We, we've caught that on EVP. Have you got You've it? Got we've caught it. It's getting louder, it's getting louder, shush. <laughs> Everyone get over here, if Simon's saying he's hearing it over there. Go on. You always do what Simon says. That's the game. It sounds to me like it's a, it's a, Mm -hmm. Right, let's everyone listen. Mm -hmm. It's almost like a reassurance. Mm -hmm. Really calm. At the same time, there's something being put around someone's neck. Oh, no, I what? Know what I just said. What? And they're being hung. hung. Knew it. What? Knew what? It. What did you just say? No, no, no. I've been standing here this whole time. What was that? That was making. And you? Did you see? And, and something I'm seeing hanging. Hanging. There. I thought you was going to say someone hung themselves from there. This feels to me like it's a it's a man. Mm hmm I thought. I, and I, I just I, got I, told I, feet don't touch the floor. Feet don't touch the floor. Hang. Yeah, shortness of breath. Yeah. All right. That makes sense. What the Whoa. fuck was that? What the fuck was that? That's him, Matt. That's. No, it won. It was above. <laughs> Someone just went, it was above? Yeah. Oh. Up there is closed off. Uh, the doors are locked. There's no floors. Just really it was weird. like you had about 20 ball bearings and in just your hand like and just that. went boom. Yeah, yeah, no. So. Yeah, yeah. Was that you? I didn't touch you. Did you touch me? <laughs> Mate, my hands are here. Swear. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> I swear to Can I stand somewhere else? Yeah. I swear to God, it was like someone, how can I describe it? Uh, imagine this is the back of my top. It's like someone went flip. You know, like flip yeah, 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 yeah. top. Oh, no. And it done it on my back. But the funny thing is, my You've coat's long really jacket. long. What's that? Yeah. What's that? There's movement What's upstairs. that? Up, it's upstairs. upstairs. Is your sound there's no floor? It sounds like there. someone's walking upstairs. The way it is here, so there is no floor. You can see the roof here. There's a door. That door is locked. There's someone walking here. It's it's over that way. Yeah, that, that's where yeah, the footstep was. There, exactly right there. Yeah. What? Do, do, do. Do, do, do. Free. Do, do, do. I felt this kind of thing before. What? A negative energy push. It's, it feels like you're pushing them and they, they're not, they're trying, but I just don't feel comfortable. I know you and I don't like the face you're giving I and how you're feeling at the minute. You feel very uneasy. I, f I, f I feel uneasy because, I, can I just ask a question in the sense of, is it all right that I'm here? You think of the times. True say, true say. Are you, is it okay for me to be here? Knock if you want us all to leave. You got that, tell me you got that low. Uh, oh my God. Swear, you got it. What was it? Uh, it's the best way I can. That was a definite response. 
we've had some interesting experiences in the card room. And Tina is keen for us to move next door to step up the hunt. That's creeping me out straight away. <gasps> what? This ain't nice. The temperature drops straight it's away. Freezing it's straight away. Freezing. Oh, I don't like that piano. Guys, gather so round, gather so round. Um, Ash, do you want to shut that door? Alex, you alright? I don't like this room at all. Why? What's wrong? I feel the energy in here is a lot more darker. So whatever resides here, I would say is more demonic. And my eyes feel like they're burning. Tina, does this... This particular room, it's one of these rooms that when people walk into, for no reason, because every room is sort of the same. Um, but like temperature drops. Sorry, it feels like someone's punching my shin on this leg. It feels like someone's literally going like that. Really? Yeah. And it had the whole time you were talking. And it just got worse, and then I just, it, someone just went like that, and that's how I was like, ah. Right, everyone, just please get comfortable. Are you happy for us to lose the yeah, lights? Yeah, go, go. Guys, let's lose the lights. Who was that? That was you. What? I heard that slap on the shoulder. Do it again. I heard that up on my touch. It's twice. It's twice. Did that? No, it was that. What was that? What was that? What was that? No, shh. You heard that voice then. Oh, don't touch it. It's just like the outside of the windows are like, barricaded from the other side. It's tapping in there. Yeah, it was like it's tapping. It's tapping in there 110%. Like percent. Percent. Yeah, 110 percent. Alex, what are you picking up? I feel this masculine energy in here, but I just That's me. That's us. I don't like it. It's like an antichrist. Oh my god. Shut up, Alex. Shut oh up. My god. I ain't got time. <laughs> I ain't got time for the devil. I <laughs> I can't deal with that. You heard that voice then. Whoa. What? Why are you laughing? What? My mouth wants that water in. What, nauseous? Yeah. I thought you had a chewing gum. No. Show yourself. Whoa. John? Got that? It did, yeah. That was behind. That's someone that the cabinet. Is it someone banged the cabinet? Whoa. Like someone That's the cabinet. It's on some someone banged the like cabinet. Like a like something that. hollow. Like a boom. Yeah, boom. boom. Yeah. No, I feel we need to go. We're gonna go. It's your last chance. Touch the REM pod. Play the piano. Give us a song. Whatever the cause of our unexplained activity so far, it seems to be drawing us onto another area of the house. We decide to continue our investigation elsewhere. The burning felt as real as someone burning me. Like it was it physically, and it stayed with you yeah, for a while. Like ball, it yeah. doesn't just like and then go away. The Constant. actual pain stays for at least I would say about five minutes. I just like said the burn at the back of my leg. Is that a red dot? You said about the burn, and didn't you? And then straight after, like I've sort of had it. Then when I looked, there was a red mark, as there was on your leg, yeah. on my back there. Alex is explaining exactly what I'm feeling. There's something being put round someone's oh, neck. No, I what? had a sense of a rope and. A hanging. And then five minutes later, that was mentioned. When she said about brushing the hair and then putting something around the neck, that's exactly what I felt. I really felt like in my head I saw somebody consoling somebody, but doing something bad to them at the same time. Then in the other room, where the piano is, it, I felt nauseous. Like my mouth wouldn't stop watering. I thought you had a chewing gum. No. Something is dark here. Ah. 
Our next investigation is in the tapestry room. We put some ghost detecting gadgets around the room and give our celebs EMF meters, which are said to help detect otherworldly forces. There's a lot of energy in this room, but low level energy. I'm seeing animals connected to this, this room in particular, or this, at least this part of the building, because you've got to remember that, you know, residual energy what, doesn't... What was that, a cat? That was a cat. That, that was, was a that? cat. John? It was a meow. Uh, yeah. It was meow! No, if yeah, yeah, I stand I, on a cat. I agree, 100%. Did that come from the machine? No. Residual energy. What was that, what was that? a cat? That was a cat. The cat-like noise did come from Simon's EMF meter. Well, it went like that and I heard a meow. It was a meow. Yeah. You said animals. You said, you said animals, animals and it, it, and it meow. went meow. Yep. Ah. I'm going to start by calling out any spirits that reside in this room. I'm seeing, seeing a young girl's spirit. Come on, step forward. Almost like she's scared to come forward. Don't it's be almost scared. like a shyness. We don't mean you any harm. The legend of the tapestry room. Uh, would be so Anne Tottenham, the daughter of the house, had relations with a dark stranger. She was very young, very, very young at the time. The legend goes that she got pregnant and she had a baby. By the and devil. By the devil, you know, or the mm. dark stranger. And, um, and they killed the baby. Oh. oh my God. And the baby was found in the wall when the house was redone. Oh, oh my God. days. The remnants of those legends that are, are attached to everything, but there's truth that cause all of these things. So Anne Tottenham did die very young. Right. Um, Ash, just check. He's going to check. Sorry. So yeah, yeah. Talking about it as well. It's kicking I, off. I hate that door being open. Mm. I feel like all we I can need see to go is the top upstairs. balustrade. <laughs> you, you're right. Doing it again. Yeah. <laughs> you ain't yeah. got asthma, have you? No. <laughs> you're right. Yeah. <laughs> Are you doing this? Is that you? It's you, isn't it? Coming up, our celebrities take some time to reflect. It feels like um, my nose is, the shape of my face is changing. As our hunt moves upstairs to the bedrooms. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Oh, fucking hell. With Simon unexpectedly suffering ill effects. You all right? Yeah, just a bit. Shop us a breath. My mouth won't stop watering. What, nauseous? Yeah. <laughs> you all right? Doing it again? Yeah. Our haunted holiday is living up to its name. Can you touch the device? Oh my god. Oh, 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 no, tell me you heard it. Like a scream. Like a. It's real man there. Oh my god, I heard it. I heard like a scratching. <laughs> no, I heard a fucking scream from that's laughing at us. What's going on with that? What's going on? What's that cat, cat again? It's the cat. <laughs> that was that. There's something wrong with that. Oh. Oh! It's like your kid's toy. It's like sooty and sweet. Yeah. I'll just test something, yeah? If I step away from this area... That sounds like a fucking child. Yeah. yeah. Can you... Can Start you it again. Touch yeah. my device again. Touch my device. It's like building energy do you want, that, do you want, and then it's... Kind of talk. I can't explain that. It's, it's like a, it's building the energy up through that just, and then it can let That's out the, the way sound. it should be. So this isn't normal? That's not normal, no. It just remains static and picks up on the it's, field yeah. until something goes around it. Yeah, yeah. No, it doesn't. Now she's back. 
I think because we're standing up, she's she's like sit down, sit, sit down, down, sit down, play, come so play. So let, let's let's sit down a second and see if that goes off. She wants to play. She wants us to sit down. Quiet, Look. Quiet. Sit down. She's at a clock. It's a clock. Oh, that click, click, click. Shh. Don't it get It's tick, tick. Do that noise again. Do that ticking noise again. Ticking. I don't know what's wrong with that. That's... Shh. Oh, my God. That was like a... You're getting this. Stopped. It's faint. John, get your right. mic right it's in still, here. It's still going. Come in. <laughs> oh. Clock. Clock again. Sorry, now that one's going off. OK, that's definitely... That's tangible, because that's going between the two. That's tangible. The, 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 for both of them to do that, seeing as they're meant stopped. to spike... It wants Mine us to stopped. sit down. I'm not stopped. sitting back oh. down. He's staying there. I'll get that. He's doing the fucking clock. Clock, air, clock again. Oh, no. <laughs> What? 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 what, 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 what I don't like it. What happened? Um, oh. What? Do it to somebody else. No, it just went like that to my hand, but in a really... Nice way? Bad way? Creepy. Don't like this man. I don't like I'm so him. I'm sorry I keep grabbing you, but I'm very okay. grabby. That clock is still going. Yeah. I keep getting nipped. Sorry, it's to me. I need to leave. Don't like it in here. Should we get out of here? I'm going. Yeah. Come. Yeah. If you're Quick. going, I'm going. Yeah. Oh my God. There's <laughs> no way. I don't like that whatever's been in here for the last, I'm going to say, couple of hundred years, I feel has been really dark. Because I've had experiences before and I've been on a hunt before, I kind of, I've walked into this open, open. I've opened up myself and and now I'm starting to get a little bit freaked out because I, I'm not sure if I'm open, opening up myself a little bit too much. You're right. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure if I want to stay or go, but I'm going to tough it out. But I will say this, Loftus Hall feels evil. So Tina, you've brought us to a staircase. I haven't got to be a scientist to work out we're probably going up. Yeah. <laughs> Why? <laughs> <laughs> OK, I'm going to bring you up to the third floor. So as we're going up, this would have been the servants' uh, staircase back in the day. Just be very aware that the energy is quite different. What Don't do you mean panic. By different? Like, dangerous? Um, I would be confident that there would be probably a lot of activity upstairs. Great. Yeah. What, more in the last room. Yeah. I'm really sorry, I keep going again. I feel sick. No, I keep thinking I'm going to collapse. I feel actually like I'm I need to, I'm serious. I'm not just taking the piss with all you lot. I need to wait a minute. I can't go up yet. Water? Yeah. Sorry. Okay. I'm really not faking it. There's a strange atmosphere and I just need to take a moment. You ready to go up there? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. Sure? Mm-hmm. you got to lead the way. <laughs> no, fucking Who's going, going first? Oh, uh, I will. Tina yeah, loves Tina. it. Tina. Tina should go first. OK. Now. Steps. It's freezing up here. It's so cold. Come on. Are we all right? Oh, my God. What's that? What is in there? We're we going in there. We're not going what in there. What is in there? That is horrible. Oh. I don't, sometimes I don't like your smile. What are you saying? Is this where we're going? <laughs> we have a chair and there's a mirror in front of the chair. And Simon, I think that you could maybe sit, look into the mirror and do a bit of scrying. 
Yeah. Have you heard of who? I've done that before, yeah. <laughs> Have you? You've done it before? I've, I've, I've scribed before, yeah. yeah. What is it? What is it? You just it's... look at yourself and then if you ask for a spirit to come through, then you for, then my reflection will form into the face. Will we see it? Yeah, you'll see it, yeah. Oh my God. Well, he'd be on his own in there. They say that oh mirror is candy. Just chop that one in. Yeah. Did you just say I'm by myself? Yeah. Oh no, no, come on. Yeah. Oh, well, that's a bit much, that babe. Do you know what? Let's do this. Oh my God. Let's do this. Yes, Simon. Balls of steel. Fuck that. <laughs> my balls have disappeared, mate. It's oh all my gosh. We're also splitting Sam and Nadia up into separate bedrooms to see if they can make contact with the other side. Okay, um, right now I'm sat down in front of a mirror. Um, we're going to do a thing called scrying. Um, and the idea is to keep staring at myself, relax, leave myself open, feel something come through, and eventually somebody or something might appear right in front of me. Um, this is something that I've done before, um, but I've never been in a room by myself. Um, so I'm very, very nervous right now, but I'm gonna try and calm myself down keep saying I don't want to see something, and hopefully this will be it. I'm going to start by saying, first of all, I mean no disrespect, but if there are any spirits in the room, please show yourself to me in this mirror. I'm, I don't think I've ever been as scared of this in my entire life. The wind as an extra added spooky level is really not necessary. It's scary enough without this menacing wind. And that big cabinet is very scary. I don't like the feeling of that cabinet at all. Um, what was that? Did you hear that whimpering? I heard actual whimpering, like, huh, huh, not wind. To, to, well, it, from the frickin' scary cabinet. Oh, I don't like it. I really, really. Make a noise touch the red light, so if there's anything in the room at all, make yourself known by either making a noise or touching the red thing so the lights shine. Is that a cough? Show me. What was that? Did the mirror just move? Just move like that. I'm not in my mouth, but it feels like my head's bigger than my own. Right, that's a shape my head. Okay, I got it. I don't know if my eyes are playing tricks on me, but it feels like um, my nose is, the shape of my face is changing. Oh, okay, yeah, it's great. So I'm not going to make any noise. If there's anything in the room, make any type of loud noise or any noise in general just to let me know you're here. Whoa, fucking hell! Coming up, our celebrities struggle to keep it together. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. And hold it down. You okay? <laughs> Our celebs are all alone in the dark. What was that? Did you hear that whimpering? I heard actual whimpering, like, huh, huh. The shape of my face is changing. Oh, okay, yeah, it's great. 
make any type of loud noise or any noise in general just to let me know you're here. Whoa, fucking hell. That was a door, it sounds like the door handle. Door's moving. I'm not, I'm, the door's literally moving. If there's anything at all near the door, please make a noise again on the door handle. Make a tap, a little sound, or even move the door. Look at the bottom of the door. It's like a shadow. See the shadow at the bottom of the door. Any kind, nice ghosties, please come forward. Please don't hurt me. I'm not here to hurt you. But come, come forward. Touch the antenna. Touch the machine. Um, and communicate with me. Oh my God! Something just happened. Something just flashed. Oh my God. 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 Oh, I just went off. Oh my God. I can put it on the floor. There we go. It's on the floor. That's what you wanted. No, this is freaking me out. <laughs> okay. You wanted this. Come on. Stick to your guns. It's looking like I. I that's me smiling. Well, I mean, no disrespect. Before we wrap this up, please, please. Use my reflection to show yourself before we leave. Ow. All right. What's that? I just felt like, like someone had like, not like a little kicking machine, like a little kid or something. It's going to time to bring the team back together to talk about their experiences. Sam, how are you? So it was, it was, to be fair, it was pretty quiet until one with the lights, nothing of the lights didn't get touched, nothing went off with the lights. Door handle, knocked. Heard it clear as day. We've been out here the whole time and no one's been near that door. Everything else was quiet, but the door handle was touched, 110%. Oh, I don't like it. Nadia? Yes? Come here, gorgeous. Bye, cabinet. Bye, ghosts. That ca there's a cabinet in there that is, like, batshit scary. Just looking at it made me feel, like, nauseous. Last back is Simon, who has been the most receptive to the singular atmosphere at Loftus Hall. Well, um, experience anything? The mirror kind of walked. Wavy, yeah. Then my nose got bigger. I wasn't... I didn't even move my mouth, but it looked like someone was smiling. Do you think it's your head playing tricks or just... And then my head got bigger. Like, it started to, like, take, take form. Well done. I wouldn't have done what you have just done. Absolutely not. <laughs> <laughs> and I still won't. <laughs> um, but, as you can see, we're outside a room that's numbered number 10. Alex, you got a very bad vibe from the room. Mm. So, I think we've had a really eventful evening. Yeah. And that, to me, Tina, I don't know if you agree, feels like the perfect place to... End up. Definitely. Yeah. Should we do it? Into room 10, yeah. Let's go. Ash, lead the way. Lord have mercy. <laughs> I mean, the cold levels in here. It just feels eerie as you walk in. You just... Yeah. It's like a bad vibe you get from here. Oh, <gasps> fuck's sake, I've just seen the ceiling. What's on the ceiling? Oh, my God. Oh, it's over there as well. Jesus Christ. <laughs> what? What? Oh, Sorry. Right. Quick. You OK? You OK? You're going to be sick. Quick. Go, 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 go. Shit. Go. I'll bring him down. I... There's a toilet. 
Yeah, I'll bring them the to the toilet. Go, go, it's going far Oh my god. Do you want to? <laughs> Do you want to go down? Yeah. Okay, okay. Oh! Oh! Ooh. You okay? Simon has been experiencing bouts of breathlessness and nausea all night. <laughs> Focus on going down the steps. Hold on to the rails. Oh my god. And now, he's overcome. You okay? What Simon is experiencing may be a coincidence. Is he okay? He's gone downstairs. But it's too big a risk to take. For the first time ever, the decision is made to shut the investigation down. We've got to get out of here. We've all felt the physical effects of Loftus's strange atmosphere. I've felt this kind of thing before. What? A negative energy. Something like burning the back of my leg. Mm. Ow! And my leg again. I feel like something's burning here, you know. Here, look, see that? There. Is that you? Loftus Hall feels evil. Shortness of breath. Just yeah. like a bit like that. Yeah, just a bit. <laughs> You're right. Yeah. I'm starting to get a little bit freaked out because I, I'm not sure if I'm opening up too much. <laughs> what? What? You okay? You're gonna be sick. You're gonna be sick. I was kind of expecting the unexpected, and I think it did happen. When you get into the rooms, you can't describe the feeling until you're actually here. I felt emotional. And when I went into the room by myself, I actually oh, no nearly burst into tears. And I don't quite like, it's silly, and it was just, I don't know whether it was just because I was so scared, but I definitely felt emotional. It just felt like there was something with me in the room. I kept calling out, asking it to show itself to me in the mirror. It just felt like my head was getting bigger, like a shape that wasn't my own was starting to form. That's telling me there's something obviously in there and all of a sudden, door handle, heard it clear as day. She got touched just subtly. There was nothing else after that, but there was definitely, definitely a noise. Whoa, fucking hell! It was weird, that noise, wasn't it, when you think about it? The room itself felt fine, and then there was a big cabinet here, like Lion, the Witch in the Wardrobe, and literally, I just turned to it, and you could hear tapping, and like, on the, um, on the cabinet, so I was kind of, trying to be like, friendly ghosts only, please. I came out, went into the room to join the others. Straight away, I felt nauseous. Felt like I was gonna be sick. I had to come downstairs, and then as soon as I left the corridor, it passed. Loftus Hall is now my number one recommendation if anyone wants a haunted holiday. This is probably the most scariest place I've ever been. I can feel it now. I can't wait to leave, and Again, anybody that comes here, good luck to you. I've enjoyed my haunted holiday at Loftus Hall, but would I come back? Not a fucking chance. <laughs>